We made it to Debbie's Peak. Not Susan's and not Lucy's. Yeah, it's, not Susan. Or Mary's, it's Debbie's. Somewhere there's a, a story behind the name. If there often is. You want to say hi to the children, Meg? That's Meg, my beautiful wife. We're hiking even though I'm sick with some kind of weird virus. From the children on my school bus, probably. That's right, I'm a school bus driver. So I have uh, 127 middle school students now. A lot of the activities are closed down. I used to have 156. Check out this beautiful view. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a photo. It's a pretty comedy. He said picture, and that's not a picture. I said an interactive selfie. <laughs> I'm sharing my uh, respiratory virus with my lovely wife here. Yeah. Yes, sharing is caring. But the hiking helps to uh, <laughs> combat the nastiness. So. And so does the sunshine. It creates D3. Our bodies yeah. produce D3 naturally when exposed to sun. Here, I'll so, show you. So, so sunlight helps. Kids are unhealthy nowadays because they're inside all the time. Yeah, you need that natural D3. So <laughs> Meg and I are encouraging you to go out and go for a walk or go hiking if you can. Yeah. All right? All right, so when Meg was talking about the sun, check this out. It's full blast right there. But don't look at it because it can cause eye damage. There's not, the sun. Not, not through a screen. All right. Oh, we did. Oh, yeah. you already did? So we hiked down this what looked like a rain uh, runoff, but it's actually cut and maintained. And down at the bottom, we found this clearing. So that's uh, the looking out north there through the trees. Uh, okay. And then um, it's actually wide enough for a car. So we wanted to check it out. So we came down here. So we're on an unlabeled trail or roadway, so that's... We're gonna go check it out anyways. It's not, yeah, that what is, do you have there, Mike? It's a four-leaf clover here, here, and this one's a five-leaf clover, which is I've never even heard of. These are, that's, that's literally a five-leaf clover. If only, if only luck were a real thing, huh? But I'm not superstitious. Meg found it here. Don't tell people where we are. It's like she wants this to be a secret spot. Well, if everybody knows about it, then it won't be quiet and peaceful anymore. The bugs know about it. I don't mind sharing with bugs. Except that you want to eat them. Just because I'm fascinated with them as an edible substance doesn't mean I want to go out and eat them per se. But it's a good to know what is edible and what is not edible in case the economy really does collapse and we have to start harvesting things. Hashtag US dollar. <laughs> I think they're the plantain family, which is very medicinal. I just don't remember why. And Wikipedia. No, I have a couple books on, on it that, that have pictures. Google search. <clears throat> a book is the internet before the internet. Yes, well, I prefer books over the internet. Books. Versus the internet. If, books if, are made using the if internet. If the internet goes down, I still have a book. Printed books can be read when there's a power outage okay. using sunlight. Precisely. My stomach's upset. I'm going to stop shooting video now. Okay.